gateway is. Oh no. I'll go get a gateway ready. Told you he'd make it. Kratos, it's Sindri and Brock. That was quite a fight. Can we? Oh, then? now. Odin is with Atreus. Oh no. I'll go get a gateway ready. Come on then. Ain't a long walk. <laughs> well, good to see you making new friends. Ain't that me old near pack of punch? You know we made that hammer, right? You have mentioned it. I know that. Wasn't ever sure you were listening. Least it was good to see the axe hold her own. Kind of the point, after all. All set. This'll get you home. Last thing there, Tiny. If you got Aesir at your door, then I reckon your protection staves busted. Once you chase Odin off, you got another place to lay your head tonight? And I don't mean that talking, though. I will not abandon my home. Oh, yeah? And what's to stop the all-fucker from spying on you? Or Raven pecking your house to splinters while you're asleep in it? Nothing, that's what. You go get your boy, and I'll speak to a certain someone about putting you up at his place in a pinch. Hey, get away from there. I told you never step off the path, you knight. Enough. I remember. I was about to look for you. Are you hurt? Are you? What does he want? To uh, pay for the roof. And he invited me to Asgard. Did he? I couldn't hear once he went outside. I told him no. Obviously. Good. Why were you searching for Tyr? If I told you I was looking for him, you would have said not to. So you hid the truth. From me. I wanted to tell you. I really did, but... Now that you know... There's something you should see. No. Just trust me, you'll want to. Trust! You have broken my trust. Then let me regain it. Let me show you what I found. Besides, we haven't seen the last of Odin. Or Thor. And clearly they can just walk in and blast holes in our home whenever they want. There's only one way to get them off our backs. I think I know how. Sir. So we gather your things.
Are you ready? Go. Change, you bastard! Where are we going? The old temple in the Wildwoods. Why? It'll be easier to explain once we're there. The door didn't say anything else while you were outside. Yeah. He said he Whoa. doesn't care about Yoden. Giants can keep their secrets. He's averted Ragnarok his own way. You think he knows all the giants are dead? I'm more concerned that it no longer matters to him. What's he up to? <laughs> what happened here? So close to home. Are raiders warring with one another now? Those are not their arrows. Something else is out here. More over here, and fresh. Did they all get in while the stave was down? That, or Odin cocked up the protection spell altogether. What do you see? Hmm, just animal tracks. Almost to the bridge. Oh, guess the bridge gave out. Gonna need another path to the temple. Why would you come out this way alone, lad? I had dreams calling me here. <sighs> dreams. <laughs> Whoa, that one's still alive. No, look closer. <sighs> Hell Raiders now? Who's doing this? Suppose it's too much to hope with an enemy of theirs to defend a Seriously, who'd be stringing up raiders like that? What was that? Something strong and dangerous. Be on guard. Oh yeah, being all the way on guard. Go. Wasn't me. <laughs> Remember when I said there was someone who might help us get answers about the giants and Loki? You mean Tyr, the old god of war in these lands, who is dead? Well, for a dead man, Odin seemed pretty keen on seeing he wasn't found. Right? He knows Tyr could unite the realms against him. Plus, Tyr was the giant's greatest ally. So... Enough. Easter! 
wasn't in the way last time I came. Like I was saying, Tyr was an ally to the Giants, so he'd be on our side if we find him. And if anyone might know who I'm supposed to be, it's him. If he's out there, we gotta find him. How can we not? Those are many ifs, Atreus. What do you know? You'll see soon. Imagine what the lad's found, but he says he has evidence. So come this far, let's see it. Many dead here. We should keep him. Too late. <laughs> Nice how Thimblewind turned wore down all the helpful magic we acquired, yet somehow new terrors only flourish. As if on cue. Ah! <laughs> 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 
has gotten rather good at that. <sighs> Yet another I've seen my share of bloodshed, but this is an awful lot for one morning. Oh no! Brother! Father! A stalker! On your guard, brother! I think you found a predator! Nisa! Winter Freya, the raiders storm out and barging in, and now stalkers playing in our woods. This is no safe haven anymore. Father, the shield Mom gave you. Thor damaged it, but now... Perhaps the dwarves could take a look at it. Perhaps. Later. Come on, we can get in this way. Why are we here, Atreus? Okay. You remember all those shrines we found, telling the stories of giants? How the panel on the left would be their origin, and on the right be their fate? Yes. We found many. I have seen them. Well, there's more to them than we realize. Well, the collapsed pillar is new, but the shrine is just on the other side. Did something give over on the right? That should help. There we go. Come on. You watching?
Well, that's new. Come on. Atreus, wait! Yeah, I don't think he's waiting. What is this, lad? Where are we? Somewhere only giants were meant to see. These shrines tell their stories to the world. But it turns out the real stories... The secret stories. Those they kept here. Inside. You remember the story of Skull and Hati? The wolf giants? Odin captured them because he thinks it'll help him control when Ragnarok starts. I remember. But that's not the whole story. See, this shows the giants setting Skull and Hati free. They're free? Is this the past or the future? Depends when you're looking at it. Spoken like a giant. See? The wolves are safe. Somewhere in Vanaheim. Not the first place Odin would look, I suppose. There they are, chasing the sun and moon. Old habits. Until, look, the moon gets stolen. Somehow. Atreus. See? Hati's got nothing to chase. And they say celestial theft is a victimless crime. Not totally sure who this is. But someone comes along and rescues the moon. And then, the moon blocks out the sun. A total eclipse. I haven't seen one of those in a hundred winters. But then they chase an arrow, and things go back to normal. What does any of this have to do with... We're coming to that. Look, here's Ragnarok. Do you see who's leading the armies against Odin? That's Tyr. If he's gonna be around at Ragnarok, that means he's gotta be alive. Right? Mumir, can this be? Odin told me he killed Tyr, and he trusted me at the time, or so I thought. What if he didn't kill him? What if he's just had him locked up somewhere all this time? We are back to ifs. Enough. Wait. We are going home. Wait! I have one more thing to show you. It's just out here. What is this? Everything I found. Well, almost everything. That's giant craftsmanship. You've been to Jotunheim again? No. I found it in one of the other shrines. Other shrines? How many have you visited? I... well... all of them? All the ones I could still get to in Midgard, anyway. I don't know what it is. But it's important. Just like all this. When I was inside one of the shrines, I saw an image of Tyr imprisoned. But I couldn't tell where. There are hints inside the other shrines. They mention... black smoke and the bleeding earth. But... We can never figure out exactly... We? Yeah, Sindri's been helping me. Look, I talked him into it. it. It wasn't his idea. I just needed someone to watch my back. Black smoke. Bleeding earth. Could the prison be in Muspelheim? Unlikely. Odin's got no presence to speak of in the primordial realms. But the bleeding elf? Sounds like a mine, aye. Uh, the realm of the dwarves, perhaps. Svartalfheim, that's a good bet. Their mines did belch black smoke, and Odin's had his thumb on the dwarves for a very long time. That's it, then. Tears in Svartalfheim somewhere, imprisoned in a mine? So? What now? 
home. This way. Lad, even if we consider looking for Tia, how do you have us getting to Svartalfine? You know Odin had all traveled between realms locked up tight. Sindri said he had an idea or two about that. Sindri is full of ideas. Huh. Ground looks kind of cracked there. <laughs> What's under there, you think? Remember when we fought our first troll out this way? I remember you lost control. <sighs> we must tread carefully, brother. Danger is close. Okay, fighting without a shield? It is not my first time. <laughs> Stepped outside, but he told us about it. I wouldn't worry. What about the things he did not tell us? curiosity against him. It goes with being young. In my youth, we learned obedience. And is that what you wish for him? Brother, he's going to walk his own path. If you don't want him walking away from you, then smarten up and walk with him a while. Hmm. If we could find a way to open Rumpstrap with a Sparta farm, I bet there'd be all sorts of useful equipment for us Enough. to... We will go. Really? But if we do not find Tyr, you will abandon your search for good. All right. You won't be sorry. Here. 
Sentry! As I live and breathe, is that Atreus? It's been so long. How you've grown. Uh, oh, uh, yeah. <laughs> well, if you'll follow me, Brock mentioned you needed somewhere safe to spend the night, and I believe your favorite dwarves can help you out with that. We're still your favorite dwarves, right? You're still the only dwarves we know. I'll take it. After you, my friends. Where are we going? The cleanest cabin in all the Nine Realms. And I'd prefer it to stay that way. Not looking at anyone in particular. Kratos. <laughs> After that Thor incident, we thought we should make up some rooms. Till you can figure out your next moves. Nearly there. We've settled here in the realm between realms. It's nothing much, but it's safe from Fimble Winter, safe from Odin's eyes. And you really can't beat the view if you're into shimmering gray voids. That's amazing, Sin. We have a plan to talk to you about, actually. Intriguing. Come in. Come in! Now, if you would just wipe your feet very thoroughly, I'll wait. You're not gonna wipe your feet, are you? Okay then, your bedrooms are there, the kitchen is just over there. Any... Anybody need a snack? Kratos? Snack? I do not need a snack. What we need is your help getting to Sparto Farm so we can try and rescue Tyr. To Tyr? Alive? I mean, that's... What? It's okay. I told him everything. Everything? You waited my son and disobeyed me. No, I, I kept an eye on him. On your behalf. Nothing risky. Everything very safe. Somebody else speak. What's important right now is that we try and open up travel between realms again. You said you know a way? Yes, I do. I just... It's just... There's... It's just a lot of mud. Then why haven't you opened the way already, man? Well, to be frank, there was... Something we needed your help with. Oh! The Holder Brothers finally require the services of the smartest man alive. That's it precisely. Hey! Not so fast. How'd that get in here? What the hell is he anyway? That is my son. Well, what in all yarns me the happen to him? He's too damn tall now. And he looks like that. I blame you. Now, well, come on, then. Let's get him something that fits, at least. He's just getting older, you dark prat. Didn't you ever have an awkward phase in your youth? Hey. I suppose what's done is done. But you'll be putting your foot down from now on if you know what's good. Oh, he's trying. Believe me. All right, let's gear you fuckers up before you go off gallop. You know this. Mmm. Busted up good. Hm. Wouldn't you rather I just whip you up a new one? It is important to me. Well, I'll see what I can do. In the meanwhile, how about I fix you up with something to get you by? I only got materials to make one of these in the here and now. You bring me more resources, we'll see what we can do.
If the kid's gonna insist on getting taller, best make a habit of swinging in for new guns. Found some items you left behind, tossed them in the chest. What would you do without me? <laughs> 